Now, Google is smart enough to understand, give you artificial intelligent results, but how does Google give? It actually takes information from us. They are actually crowdsourcing. So, those who don't know about Google Guides, you can become a volunteer and you can actually name the businesses, upload pictures, and do all the things that you want other businesses to take care of. And they are using you to outsource crowdsource all those things. So that's number one you have to think about. Okay, how many of you are using Google My Business? How many of you know what is my Google My Business? How many of you don't know what is Google My Business? It's okay. Okay. So Google My Business is a free listing that any company that you want to look for. It is a free listing and that's the number one thing if you are a local business. So whenever you go and search for a brand or a company, the first thing on the right hand side that comes in is Google My Business. So if you are not using Google My Business, that's the number one thing that you might want to do. It is free of course, it takes five minutes to set up and that's the easiest way to get into Google. You can do all search engine optimization, but bringing to the context today, we are talking about local businesses, this is the number one and free resources. Google My Business, you have to get verified with your business. So you give your business address, phone number, and pictures and videos, it will go and they will send you a postcard and that will verify. That's the number one thing that you can do. Now, so how many of you do Google My Business already? Okay. Uh, let me ask you, what is new in Google My Business? Post. No, <coughs> adding new posts. How many of you say post? Okay, not WMA students, by the way. Anybody else? Yes. Post. Okay. Post. Okay. So, how many of you are blogging here? Blogging. Okay.